In order to pay off a debt stemming from an investment he made in fast food, Chris Brown might have to give up part of his assets and income. The singer was sued by City National Bank in Georgia last year, claiming that he hasn't paid back a loan that he and a few other people, including The Dream, took out to buy two Popeyes restaurants in California. Their ideas never materialized, and the debt is still unpaid, according to a report by BNN on Sunday, March 3. A LA court has now ordered the RB singer to pay his $1,760,654.11 bill. According to records that the journal was able to get, Breezy has 30 days to reply to the ruling. If he doesn't pay, he will be forced to part with his belongings. A writ of execution or other type of enforcement may be issued per this court's order. The document warns that your property, money, and wages could be seized without more notice from the court. The property levied on will not be distributed until 30 days after you are served with this notice, if enforcement procedures have already been issued, according to reports, the bank has made multiple attempts to collect the loan since 2018, the lawsuit states that as of February 17, 2023, the borrower and guarantors owe $2,140,901.74 in unpaid principal and interest, with a $71 million dog attack lawsuit being contested by his former housekeepers, Chris Brown is currently negotiating the Terms of his most recent legal battle According to court records, the 34-year-old's defense team requested that the trial be moved from September 2023 to December 2023 by the Los Angeles Superior Court, the housekeeper who filed the lawsuit against Brown, according to Brown's lawyers, would not be harmed by the new date. Furthermore, his team contended that because the bitten maid is still receiving medical attention in accordance with her workers' compensation claims, they are unable to obtain crucial evidence that would enable them to move forward with the trial. Patricia Avila claims in a People article that one of Brown's two dogs attacked her sister, Maria, back in 2020 while they were taking care of his house, the lawsuit claims the dog, a Caucasian of Charka, barked at her and proceeded to viciously attack her when she entered the backyard to take out the vacuum.